there, friend. Be seeing you. This is a restricted area. State your business. Your being here is a start, soldier. We aren't exactly overflowing with troopers here. But if you really want to help us, talk to the idiot with sunglasses in the back of the plant building. He's been trying to get this place running for months and hasn't made any forward progress. There should, but we're not getting much power out of it, so none of our enemies have big interest in it either. Not like Hoover Dam, anyway. We had a real fighting force here just long enough to take it from the Brotherhood of Steel. Then they got sent east to the dam like everybody else. Caesar's Legion sends skirmishers every so often, prodding for weaknesses, mostly. The reality is, if they really wanted it, we'd all be dead. Damned if I know. Put up a hell of a fight, though. We had them outnumbered, I don't know, 20 to 1, maybe? They held out as long as they could, lost most of their force before they retreated. Gave us a little parting gift, too. They had some of the plant running, but they shut it all down. Enabled an old security system, too, to keep us away from the controls. Jerk-offs. I ask myself the same question all the time. But energy is hard to come by around here. Gives you more control over this area than troops ever could. Hell, if we lose the dam to the Legion, this little plant may be our last stand. Later. the hell are you? They bring you in to replace me? They're replacing me, aren't they? 
damn right you're not. God damn right. Why would they? You can't top this guy. Just a little more time. You can't keep Fantastic down for long. What else? I'm in charge. This whole operation depends on me. No Fantastic, no power. Got the whole NCR suckling my teats, and it feels so good. Well, see, we're getting power because the guy running this place is fantastic. But the mirrors outside aren't aimed right, so we're running at 1% efficiency, and I guess that just isn't good enough for some assholes. Trouble is, most of the controls for this place aren't here. They're in the tower. And that place has some crazy pre-war security system that the dumb shit NCR set off when they took over. Killed two guys. Now they won't go near it. They want me to make an omelet, but I can't break any of their eggs. Know what I'm saying? There's these two terminals outside. They control the mirrors. I tried fooling with them, but didn't get very far. You'd have to get them to talk to the mainframe up in the tower, then do the rest from up there. I'm guessing, but it sounds good, right? Hey, you're not thinking about going up there, are you? Well, hey, if you find yourself up at the mainframe, do yourself a favor and make sure you send the power to the right place. It needs to go to the Strip and McCarran. Because I get paid, that's why, per kilowatt hour. Whatever the hell that is. That's where the NCR wants the power, so that's where I want it. But you know, you do that, maybe I put in a good word for you with them. Fantastic's little helper. There's a reputation you can hang your hat on. It was easy, man. They were going door to door asking if anyone knew any scientists. I said look no further. They asked me if I knew anything about power plants. I said as much as anyone I had ever met. They asked me how well I understood theoretical physics. I said I had a theoretical degree in physics. They said, welcome aboard. Here. you want this. It's the password to one of the terminals outside. Found it written on one of the stalls in the bathroom.
Howdy there, partner. My story's a long one, friend, and I can't say as it's all that interesting. Well, I was born in a little town out Montana way. Me and Ma didn't have much ever since my pa up and left. That he did. Never did know why. Ma always said he was a real mysterious fella, even when he was with her. Like he was a stranger sometimes. Maybe. Maybe I just never felt like I belonged back home. It sure wasn't easy. Ma worked her fingers to the bone to make sure we had enough to survive. And I worked the coal mines from when I was 15. After Ma died, I guess I wanted to find my pa and get some answers from him. Been out here looking ever since, but he ain't an easy man to find. Can't say as I really know. Maybe I'll just ask him why. Maybe I'll punch him right in the mouth. Well, the more I talk about it, the more the whole damn thing sounds like a dumb idea. Maybe I should. Don't suppose you know any place a fella with a guitar might find a job, huh? Ah, well, it was worth a shot. Oh, this old thing? Why, thanks, friend. This here guitar is just about the only thing my daddy left me. Just about my whole life, ever since my daddy left Ma and me and went off to roam the wastes. Long time ago now, I never even knew him. Ma always said he was a mysterious fella, always traveling on in secret. So long, friend. We've got a situation with some great cons right now. The brass at McCarran has ordered me to lock down the ruins until it's been resolved. One of my patrols was on its way back from Novak when it came under fire from the great cons. They radioed for reinforcements, but instead of waiting for us, they chased the cons into the ruins where they were caught in a crossfire. No deaths, but not all the squad got out. The cons have Private Ackerman and Private Gilbert as hostages. Once the great cons have been killed or captured, you're welcome to retrieve any property they've taken from you. Normally I'd turn you down since I have no idea who you are, but considering that the hostages are as good as dead when we attack... All right, I'm going to give you a chance to talk to the great cons. Their leader is a man named Jessup. If we hear shooting, we'll be coming in, but it'll probably be too late for you. Good luck.
Hope the NCR doesn't send reinforcements from the dam. The NCR sure did a number on this place. What the hell? You're that courier Benny wasted back in Good Springs. You're supposed to be dead. Yeah, uh, about that. Don't have it. Benny stole it right before he stabbed us in the back. He's probably back at the strip by now laughing at me. What's the negotiate? The NCR backs off, we walk out of here, nobody gets hurt. I can't believe I'm doing this. But all right, the hostages can go. The NCR had better keep their end of the deal, though. Here, a souvenir for you. It's Benny's lighter. Shove it up his ass when you catch up with him. Yeah? On what? He's one of the chairmen, big shots that run the Topps Casino in New Vegas. A friend from the city contacted me with info on a big job. I should have known that the caps were too good to be true. But there was still no way I could pass up the chance. It's just a big fancy poker chip, as far as I know. Don't know why anyone would make one out of platinum, though. He's a snake, that's why. He owed us the rest of the pay for the job, so... Maybe he didn't want to pay up. Fine. Eh, go on. I'm glad you were able to get my people freed, but there's a new problem. I just got orders to take out the Great Khans, hostages or not. My hands are tied. I can't go against orders, can I? You're right. The Great Khans are free to go. 